Well, this is a good bit of time. Let's start it here, shall we? So, morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever the fluff you are. And yes, as you can see, this is another catch up of that there demolition site. And, wow, well, that does look like quite a good chunk of that has been moved since the last time I saw that. So I think maybe if I just stand my way backwards a little bit. Well, it looks more like more made more headway into the side of the building, munching their way through it. And I think, judging from what I can see and what I can hear, these metal monsters over here are uh, going through the rubble which has been moved over to them and is uh, picking it up, sorting it and moving it to another pile as we can see one mechanical monster over there which I think is a long reach resting so that'll be uh, a lot of fun with that thing anyway, let's have a look down the bottom end see how that's going down there and then uh, we might just be able to catch in because I'm having to do this one in chunks since I've got other things going on today so uh, this will be up in uh, chunk. well it won't be up in chunk, it'll be recorded in chunk not all one long continuous run like I usually do them so unfortunately uh, the pause won't quite be a normal pause it's going to be a full stop but, wow that is uh, quite a nice munch from one level and then soaring up that is definitely getting munched in a different way but as we can see over here we've got some scaff appearing so it looks like we're probably going to have to possibly uh, be more careful when they're uh, going over here just because like there is that void it looks like they're uh, taking a good munch at that and going through that part of the void and then obviously this bit where it cuts in closer to the street and the uh, edge of the corners this is where the road is to get all the scaff going up so I think we're gonna have to do this bit a bit more careful than what we've been doing some of the others that's how close it is and there's not a lot of space we will probably have to uh, be a lot more careful and probably take some of that down uh, a little bit more kind of like hand mechanically rather than uh, full on machine but you can just about see the uh, the light peering through there in that bit a pile of rubble which is ever growing over here and then as I uh, surmise those uh, mechanical monsters over there look like they're uh, digging, moving and sorting Let's see if I can get a better look over here and then we've got all the way through to this part it's going to be a lot of noise yeah, at least I filled all these little uh, pile holes in anyway but yeah, all the scaff is going up around here so it looks like this is going to be kind of more say kind of like hand demolition so we're going to have like you know the hand like the, the hand machines going on the hand breakers rather than using the uh, the diggers and the pullers which is going to be interesting so the public on the road and in the corners and passing on the buses is going to get a little bit of a view when they start pulling this down which that's going to be quite interesting well, I've got a bit of time, let's go around the other side, so, so I might be able to do a quick pause. So for the moment, I will give you a quick pause. Well, hoardings are moving. So this is uh, changing again. Hoardings over here are coming down. Most of the hoardings over there are coming down, and some of the others over there back end are coming down as well so a few things are happening over here as you can see the uh, guy in the moving picker over there and then as we zoom in 
can see the bits that are missing from this angle. Mm, coming down quite quick. Anyway. Let's go over now. So to see if anything much has changed over here. Doubt it, but still got the uh, mystery sinkhole. I think that's going to take some time to sort out. But that box there now that we've filled the gap in for. The flooring around here is getting a little bit more warped. So I think possibly the sinkhole might start growing. Especially with the amount of rain that we're supposedly we're going to have. But I suppose the rain will help these guys keep all the dust down from over here. It's going to be quite cool. But as you can see, there is a lot of mess over there, which has happened. And I don't get my arm stuck. You can see that bit which has gone down, which is going right over where the uh, the uh, I say the portal to go down to the underground section is. And uh, marvelous mound of muck, one roller. Won't be long though. Won't get much time to uh, appreciate this view. And it won't be long until the steelwork and all sorts of other framing goes up around here, and all sorts of other bits and pieces. So this won't be uh, long standing like it is and as I've been told a few times now apparently the, uh, the clock is staying which I'm not 100% sure if it is or not but people have heard that it's staying and other things so I'm, on, I'm just going to see what basically happens because you never know things might change yeah the idea of it might be that it might now stay or in the end it could end up going anyway who knows but anyway I will give you a pause for now and I will catch up later in the day. Pause. As we can see, it's a bit clean around here. It's looking pretty clean around here. So everything looks like it isn't too far away actually. Um, we've got that digger right there that's been doing uh, looks like he's been doing a bit of clean up. Quite a few other bits and pieces. Uh, also they're getting ready to start marking out wherever like you know steel work and all sorts of other stuff for the framing is gonna go and whatever else over here. We'll try and keep this bit quite brief, quite short. Whilst we're between showers. Can give you a quick look through here as well. Right now, we've got another one of the like, electric cupboards, and we've got like, the generators and bowsers and stuff over here, and a few of the other bits and pieces for all of the, the work and everything going on, and uh, all of that lot. Anyway, let's just um, end it there before it starts to tip it down again. So if you want to contribute to the quest to 500, then uh, give us a sub a dub. If you like what you see, give it a thummy thumb, and give it a likey like. You know, even if you don't like what you see, you can vote it down. Those two interactions mean the same thing. If you've seen yourself or you want to comment on something, you want to say anything that I've missed or whatever, then uh, comment it uh, down below. So I will see you next time with another random thing, either more catch up here, a random ramble, sport, a vlog of some sort, I do not know. So I will sign out, I will see you star side, remember you only get out of life what you put into it, don't expect anything for nothing, don't drive yourself insane, I will see you star side, peace out and goodbye.